Hello everybody, From this is John from Hillbilly Wine 101. Today I'd like to show you my cool wine stopper collection, or at least I think it's cool. Just different ones I've collected over the years. And uh, start with this set of three here, kind of cool, made out of different colored marble. And then we have this one here, which is a, uh, says happy birthday, Valentine's Day, wedding. Uh, this one here, just a pewter, heavy, painted pewter. This one here is cool. Uh, Napa Valley, obviously I picked it up, California. It's got a pig on it. This one here, Sonoma, the old chicken. This one here is cool. I got it in Italy. It's hand carved, Pinocchio. Uh, another painted pewter of Betty Boop. Picked this up in Seattle. These are cool kind of souvenirs. It's got the uh, space needle. That's just a uh, kind of a metal one with a crown on it. Same here. It's got some polished mahogany wood. Picked that up in New York City. Um, this is a glass one here, just heavy grapes. This is the one I use the most. It's just plastic. It does a tight squeeze. Got that from Andy Harper. He's always picking stuff, cool stuff up for me. And uh, the reason I use this one is because they're more. The rest of these are more for decorations, and this one I actually uh, use uh, when I have uh, excess wine, which isn't often. And then my favorite one from Wendell. I like to give a shout out. Is this cool Mercedes Benz uh, collection? It's uh, they're in the form of stick shifts. How cool is that? Um, and then the writing course is in English and uh, German what type of wine, uh, different types of wine white wine, red wine, uh, rosé and champagne and they are really cool and I'd like to thank Wendell for that and I thought you all might be interested in my wine stopper collection as always I'm going to ask you to hit the like, hit the subscribe I try and put on a lot of different stuff, interesting stuff some you'll like, some you might not be as interested in but you don't have to watch it. Hit me up with a subscribe and share if you know somebody who might be interested in seeing this. And from Hillbilly Wine 101, cheers.